We do have some unusual weather moving uh, through California today with some isolated thunderstorms. Let's go ahead and get you into your microclimate forecast and you can see the loop right now. You felt it if you were outside. It was kind of strange, tropical. Uh, you got a few raindrops and we did also have some lightning primarily off to the east and the south of us. We're going to get you back to the radar, but I wanted to show you what is really the primary source of this wild and wacky weather. It's all about tropical storm Frank. It's way to the south of us. Winds at 50, but check this out as I put on the path of this. It's going to go parallel to California here by Thursday with winds of 25 miles per hour. Now this is expected to dissipate, so we're not expecting a landfall with this system by any means, uh, but it does bring up the point. When have we had a tropical system uh, moving in? I took a look back at history and just north of San Francisco, we had a tropical cyclone back in 1854. So uh, getting one this close is definitely very unusual. You might also be asking yourself why why aren't there more tropical systems hitting California? It's because of our cold water and also our very gusty wind pattern near the coastline. What you need is some warmer waters and also some calm winds to really make these tropical systems grow. So again, Tropical Storm Frank, one of the primary reasons why we're getting this moisture boost moving in. Now, high pressure out here is also pumping in some monsoonal moisture, so it's really a one-two effect here on this uh, tropical field today. So as we take you into the radar, I'm not seeing anything really serious serious over land. We've got a few spotty showers. I am looking at some lightning developing offshore. Two strikes. This may hold up into Bodega Bay by 553. Of course, we're going to have more updates this as we head into our 530 show. Otherwise, as we started off for tomorrow morning, I'm keeping that chance of some spotty activity with temperatures here in the 60s across the Bay Area. 60 in San Francisco, East Bay at 62. Daytime highs for tomorrow, a mix. We've got 80s through our inland valleys, 70s near the Bay. 80 in Palo Alto, 60s at the coast. On my seven day forecast, you'll see a spotty chance, as we mentioned, tomorrow of thunderstorms. Hold on to some humidity into Wednesday, and we'll have 60s for highs in San Francisco and through the inland valleys. Some low 90s Wednesday and Thursday, and then plenty of 80s coming our way. We're back with more news right after this break.